The apparent murder of a young college student in one of Cleveland's trendier neighborhoods has police and those who knew the victim baffled tonight. News Channel 5's Deborah Lee is in our newsroom with the latest on the homicide in Tremont. And Deb, do police know anything more tonight? Well, they say they don't, and they want the public's help. 21 year old Brandon Cardalone was a promising product designer. His death was a total shock to his college family at the Cleveland Institute of Art. This is a video Brandon Cartalone made for a spring foundation show at the Cleveland Institute of Art. His industrial design instructor says his death is truly a loss. He was an amazing student. Brandon's body was found inside his apartment overnight in the heart of Tremont, tree-lined streets scattered with trendy boutiques and restaurants. Police say they found some cash and a marijuana growing system in Brandon's apartment. He'd been shot in the abdomen, his wrist and ankles bound. But the Brandon Cardalone, who Professor Dan Cofaro remembers, was in his school's computer lab about six weeks ago, preparing for an internship. Very, very talented, thoughtful person. Um, meticulous. Uh, uh, paid attention to the details of what he was doing. Very innovated, innovative, um, carefree, laid back, but. Um, absolutely a perfectionist when it came to his work. The Cleveland Institute of Art posted news of Brandon's death on its website and encouraged students to contact its counseling service provider. Brandon would have been a junior here in another four weeks. In the classroom, he was the kind of person that you really like to work with. Uh, it, um, I wish the situation was different. It's just, it, it's a shame in so many ways. Now, I got an email from Cleveland police tonight saying that they still have no suspects in this case, and they're asking that you call their homicide unit with any information that can help them solve the case. That number is 216-623-5464. In the newsroom, Deborah Lee, News Channel 5.